Howdy, Jake here, and uh, today is Sunday. Just wanted to uh, document uh, our week without water. About a, w a week ago, I don't know, uh, I'm not sure if it's a pump, but most likely uh, um, the actual <coughs> pipe that is connected to the pump um, that uh, went bad, and uh, we've been out of water for, like I said, about a week. Um, my pump sits at uh, 430 feet under the ground. Uh, the well itself is about, uh, well, yeah, about 710 feet. So it's a deep well pump. I'll have to hire a company to uh, bring it bring it up to the surface to see what's wrong with it. And uh, the pipe itself is not a one continuous piece. It's a section of uh, 20 feet uh, plastic pipe. So it kind of requires a crane. It needs to be uh, lifted out by 20 feet off the ground in order to uh, take it apart in sections. But um, in the meantime, um, for a week now, uh, let me, uh, <laughs> for myself and for everybody else who will be interested, kind of describe what we've been doing without water. I've been, um, for dishes, we switched to paper plates and uh, all, all the plastic utensils uh, and on the short run it's it's, it's doable um, in the long run probably would have to start washing dishes in a uh, in the sink or in the, t in the tub so some some sorts um, but for uh, for showering and the other necessities uh, well let me show you what we what we've been doing for a week now so yeah all of our camping gear uh, came in handy. This is just a, a Walmart bought a little uh, stool uh, that we use on our camping trip. Under it uh, there is a bucket and um, there is a second bucket with a bunch of dirt. And basically you do your business covered with dirt and uh, there is no smell and it, uh, it's definitely not as convenient um, as uh, pressing the lever and flushing the toilet but um, but it definitely can be done we've done it for a week and uh, no pleasure in it but it's uh, it's doable and for shower um, last summer for a camping trip I bought this portable outdoors shower that works great um, it uh, it has a, a battery run a pump, a bucket of a five gallon bucket, bucket of water, and it gets heat up by um, one of those liquid propane tanks, and it uh, uh, it works well. Except uh, probably the only inconvenience is you have to hold the shower um, uh, head uh, in in your hand uh, while taking a shower, which if it would be on the long run, one can probably come up with some kind of solution to fix it up. And um, another thing is, uh, of course, the water flow is not the same as uh, um, the regular uh, the regular flow. But uh, yeah, it's um, um, that's the way we've been handling it, and uh, the water itself, I've been uh, bringing it from. Uh, from my work in uh, five or seven gallon jugs uh, I have I bought a few of them uh, so it's definitely not uh, in case of uh, outright uh, some kind of collapse uh, calamity uh, because then water is at least clean water is not going to be available uh, so anyone who is prepping for for that kind of events, um, like I said, either natural disasters or um, economical calamities, um, that that's something that needs to be given the thought of uh, how to get drinking water. For all of our water from the well, we, I'm for probably last twenty years or so. I've been filtering it anyway. <clears throat> so yeah, that this is. Uh, uh, the gravity 
filter uh, made by a Swiss um, company Catadin and uh, it's been uh, working up this this one has been around for uh, probably close to 20 years that we had it um, I changed the filters elements itself which probably are due to be changed pretty soon anyway uh, but yeah that's what it um, there's three filter ceramic filter elements there I have changed those probably I don't know I'm every couple of years or so um, so um, the beauty of it is it doesn't require pumping nothing you just fill it up and uh, and it's uh, um, under the gra for, uh, force of gravity just uh, filters through and depending on the source um, uh, it, they can be uh, they can go like I said for about a couple of years if, if the water is really dirty you'll have to change the elements more often but you can take uh, it uh, filters out bacteria viruses uh, I, I think pretty much makes uh, any kind of water drinkable and um, that's it thanks for watching see you next time